official YouTube channel for Santa J Claus. Be sure to subscribe for new content and comment below to introduce yourself. May the magic of Christmas brighten your days all year long. <laughs> Well, hello there, my friends. Hello there, and best wishes to each of you. I'm so very excited to be able to be here with you today. We are doing another art live streaming. Again, the series is painting inspiring individuals from A to Z. And today is the letter M. M is for Malala Yousafzai. I'm so very excited to be able to paint this individual. Quite an inspiring individual indeed. Barbie has joined in. Bethany, our wonderful moderator, has joined in as well. And I am looking forward to getting started. It is going to be another very, very quick one if we can, my friends, today. I have so very many things to do on the plate today. But we will try our very best to do the very best job we possibly can. The very first thing that you will see in the artwork, my friends, you will see that I have gone through and we have penciled in our artwork. I'm using a Faber-Castell pencil. This is an HB pencil. They make all different types of pencils with the different densities of, the, of, of what we're writing with. This one here is very soft. Now, why might it be important? Well, it's important because as we're using something that's soft in, in the graphite of the pencil, the lead of the pencil, as they call it, well, when it is very soft, we can be very gentle and it will still right. We do not need to mark and press into the paper. This is very important as we're going to be erasing the pencil later on. We want to be able to have it there just for a temporary moment. <laughs> so this is what we've gone through and done. I've gone through and we've penciled in. We've penciled in all that all that we have here. I'm going to go through and do some just directional things here on the hair that will help me out later on, right? Malala, a wonderful individual. Barbie, if you want to start sharing some of the details, that would be wonderful. Daniel, hello there. Happy Thursday. Santa and Bethany. Well, happy, happy Thursday. I almost said happy birthday, Daniel. <laughs> happy Thursday, Daniel. Noah has joined in as well. Good morning. Good morning, my friends. Good morning and best wishes to each of you. Here we are, shall we start? Now that we have it all penciled in, we're going to go through, use a zebra brush pen. This is the extra fine, the blue one, my friends, the blue one. And I'm going to go through and we're going to ink all of this wonderful, wonderful pencil drawing. We will do the best that we possibly can. I am looking forward, my friends, to when our wonderful, our wonderful time in painting, our live streamy time is not needing to be rushed by so very many things going on. This certainly will be a wonderful thing. Wonderful, wonderful. We will go through here. Welcome, Tyler has joined in. Hello there, my friend. Best wishes to you. We move this around just a little bit, get a very good view. I'm working with a, a, a picture, a wonderful picture. There we are, beautiful scarf. Well, 
This has so very many details that I am noticing right here, my friends, that we're going to go through and we're going to give an approximation of this one. We will try our very best to put in some of the designs. But this is going to be more so what it will what it will look like. As I've said before, oftentimes we're not looking to to create something that is perfect. We are looking to create something that will spark the imagination as well. So this is something that we can we can do. We know that there is designs, beautiful designs on on all of all of this here. So I'm going to go through and and try to do some of the designs on this very intricate scarf. So very many designs that are here. So we're going to go through here and give just a a floral pattern as there is. We will try our very best to spark the imagination. I hope that everyone is having a wonderful day. She won many awards, including the Nobel Peace Prize, Glamour Award for the Girls Hero, Asian Game Changer Awards. My goodness, what a remarkable individual. She continues to inspire so very many people. Also working hard, my friends, in the importance of making sure that women receive the education that they deserve. This is oftentimes in many parts of the world not taking place. So I'm going through here, my friends. And we are doing just a random designs in here that are evoking what I'm seeing from the from the photograph and I'm thinking as I'm in such a hurry today well I'm thinking that perhaps I might not should add so very many details. <laughs> but we will get there. We're getting there, my friends. We're getting there. 
She's a writer, education activist, human rights activist, blogger, and women's rights activist. What a wonderful, wonderful individual. She's also a survivor as well. Very important. So we will go through here and add in just a little bit of detail here. And it also carries through down in, in here as well. We want to have this line very straight, this, this jawline here. And here we're going to go through and section off part of what we're seeing here. So we have a little section of hair that is going through here. And I'm going to go through here and put in some hair. I'm going to move this around as we're going to go through here and create a little bit of a little part in her hair. You see the part on the one side we've created, now we can go through and create the other side of the part. part somewhat fades away as it goes in the back there, the angle changes. I'm going to go through and also add in just little darker sections in here. The hair is very, very dark. Because there's so very much shadow along this line in here. And we will try our very best. There's a lot of of shadow all along in here as well.
more room to go through here. Add in just a little bit more shadows along in here as well. Oh, we're getting there. Hello there, hello there, my friends. Carrie's here. Hello there, Santa. There are so very many inspiring people whose names begin with M, so it must have been very difficult. It was a very difficult decision, my friend. Very difficult indeed. I tried my very best. But what it came down to with so very many individuals that are so wonderfully inspiring it truly came down to well I have to tell you it came down to the example of the strength in young people this is something that I found so very inspiring with Malala Not only, my friends, did Malala grow up within a community that did not find a lot of, did not have a lot of respect for her as an individual, not only as a woman, but also as a child. And she has been able to inspire so very many individuals. This, I think, is so beautiful. So I will do the very best I can to light, highlight her as a wonderful individual, an inspiring and uplifting individual as well. We are getting there. putting in her eyebrows as well. You will notice, my friends, that when I am penciling them in, I pencil in the overall shape. And then when I ink it in is where I can think a little bit more about the individual hairs. Wonderful. Now we can move on to...
move on to her nose. My mom worked at a hospital where she was treated after she was flown to the United Kingdom, but she didn't meet her. I know several people who have, though. How wonderful. I'm always inspired when we are seeing the the resilience and the strength of individuals, a wonderful, wonderful thing. And sometimes it, they are the individuals that have gone through so very much and have chosen above all of it to be able to continue to inspire. I think this is wonderful. Well, we are going to get right into the painting. No wasting time. And I also did not put in the circle yet. Let's do our circle. There we are. And we will go ahead and ink this as well. There we are. Now as we are here, my friends, let's go through and erase all of the pencil marks. There we are. I'm going to go through here and let's, I think I'm going to go through and put in a little, we're going to do the circle in purple. Let's, let's get that started. And Bethany, what type of painting are you working on currently? I hope that it's a good one. As an oil painter, I suspect that you have many, many paintings you're working on all at one time. A nice purple in the background. The reason I'm picking purple is her beautiful scarf in this photo is pink. But 
there was a, an opportunity, a, another option in another photograph that I liked, that the scarf was purple. So we're going to do the purple circle and go with the pink scarf. And there we are, my friends. Noticing also. We might need just a little extra purple in this side. There it is. And blow dryer. I'm going to go through and do some of the designs of this wonderful scarf. We're looking at all of the tones, all of the colors that we have here. We're going to start with a, a gold. Where are we going to do the golds? Well, there are quite a few little spots in here that we will do this with. Remember, we, we spoke on, it does not need to be perfect. We, we are trying to give the idea of what we are seeing, but it does not need to be perfect, my friends. Do not put so much pressure on yourself. Kind of going through this very quickly. We're giving just the ideas of of colors through this. And then we're going to go through, let's do blow dryer on these separate colors. Now I'm seeing another color in here that's not as strong as our, our golden color, but there's a little bit of a there's a little bit of a a turquoise here and there. So we shall do this as well. Just in a few little spots. Now that we have our teal, we're going to now go with the star of the show. Which will be pink and blow dryer. I just finished up a pet portrait commission about to start on two more. Wonderful, wonderful, Bethany. Oh, yes, there's about 15 in progress, my goodness.
example I saw one recently of yours it was quite good my friend with all of the bees on it I'm going to go with a pink you want a nice saturated pink And we will go through here and try not to try not to mess up all of our wonderful other colors that we put in here. Remember, it does not need to be perfect, my friends. We are going to try our very best. This is the wonderful thing about good brushes as well, is you'll notice that I have not put in I have not dipped into the paint at all since I started as the brush has filled in quite a bit with paint. We are getting there. Her favorite color is pink. Wonderful. Well, here I am trying to hurry so that I can get on with another very important project here in the north. And I have picked a painting that has all of these little details in it. My goodness, my friends. I'm hoping that I will be able to complete it before we need to go. Almost there, my friends. And blow dryer. Okay, it still looks amazing as always. It's very kind of you, Barbie. I'm going to go through and just brighten up the pink just a little bit more. I really want this pink to be quite powerful. A powerful pink.
So I asked a question recently in the community section of our page on if at Easter time you are more likely to enjoy an Easter bunny chocolate or an Easter egg chocolate. I'm very curious. Would you prefer an Easter egg or an Easter bunny? Wonderful. And blow dryer. Wonderful. Now I'm going to go through while I'm thinking about it because I always am forgetting. I'm going to just knock down just slightly. Knock down the, the whites of her eyes, just, just a little. Does not need to be a lot. You'll notice that it's not, not a lot. And I'm going to clean just a little section on the palette. We're going to be mixing some skin tone. I'm going to go through and we're going to water this down quite a bit. I'm going to go through and let's do a very quick over almost just a, a toning of the skin at first. Very, very lightly. I'm going to go through, and now we're going to add in just a little, a little pink to it as well. We're going to do this in lots of layers, so do not worry about the color yet. And blow dryer. What happens when I'm in a hurry, my friends? <laughs> Good morning, Gail. Good morning.
where's all of the shadows? Oh, we're going to add some shadows in here. Where are they taking place? There's quite a bit of shadow right along in here. All along in here as well. And blow dryer. Lala doesn't remember anything about that day. Good morning, good morning, my friends, and best wishes to each of you. darkening up her hair right here and then we're going to do her eyes as well I'm going through and we're starting with a somewhat brighter color. And we will blow dry this. I'm going to go through with a little bit of a darker brown now. And we're going to go through and, and paint her, her eyes just a little bit more.
As the paint is wet also, my friends, you'll notice that we can certainly we can certainly pull some of the paint off as well with a drier brush. Now I'm going to go through here. I want to add in just a little bit more just overall tone. I'm going to blow dry this. And let's give it a try. Let's go through, we're going to add just a little bit more of the red. Just a little bit. Did you hear when I said a little bit? Well, apparently the paintbrush did not agree with me. We're getting there, my friends, we're getting there. And blow dryer. And we're going to go through and mix in some of our shadows. We're going to do a dark blue, dark purple. As we do this, this will be our shadow layer. Where do the shadows lie? This is this is where we will spot where those shadows are. Go through here and just add in some shadows here and there. Just to give it a little bit of depth, what do you think? She helped 10 million girls get their education. Hello, it looks it's looking great. Obi, Mom, Kenobi, well, hello there, my friend. And welcome, welcome. I'm just going to strengthen some of these shadows in here with our shadow color. Kind of brighten, brighten the smile as well. What a remarkable individual. Let's 
certainly, certainly a remarkable individual. She is so beautiful, an amazing individual. And we also do not want to forget, as sometimes we do, that there's also a little shadow on the eyes as well, from the eyelid above it. So we're going to add in just that little bit of shadow as well, right in there. Now I'm going to Bring in just a little bit more color. Maybe a little bit more pink. And water it down just a bit. We're going to go through and brighten up there and blow dryer. Wonderful. Now what we're going to do here is I'm going to start to add in just a little bit of highlights here and there. And as I'm thinking of it, we're going to put in just a little bit more shadow as well. Right on, right in here. Wonderful, and blow dryer. And now we will do those highlights. In just a moment. <laughs> Just along in here, if our uniball signal will cooperate, we'll put a little highlight in here as well. There it is. Now, where are some of the highlights that we're seeing? Well, I'm seeing just a few little highlights right in there as well. And I'm going to put in just a few little highlights in here. I'm going to put in some highlights in here as well. And do some more right in here. And then we certainly will do a There we are.
So what do you think, my friends? I think we're there. Lovely Santa. She's so beautiful. I will go read about her once the stream is finished. Wonderful. And my friends, I am going to create a wonderful little video for all of you to be able to enjoy as well. There we are. Let's do a tape peel. And my friends, we managed to do it within an hour. A wonderful thing. As I have so very much happening in the workshop today. But I'm happy that we were able to make the live streamy work. We'll do our tape peel. And here we have our letter M, Malala. Yusafzai is her last name. A writer, an activist, a hero to many, and truly an inspiration for so very many. There she is, my friends. I'm wishing you all good things, all good things indeed. We did it, my friends, we did it. We completed another painting. I'm wishing you all happiness to all of those that have joined in. Bethany, she looks wonderful. Very kind of you to say, Bethany. My friends, I'm wishing you all good things. I truly hope that you will take some time to maybe watch a few of the videos, especially the longer videos is always so very important. And in just a few hours, I'm going to post a video all about Malala. And I hope that you will watch it. You can let me know in the video, in the comments, that you are here on the live stream to watch the whole thing take place. My friends, be kind, be good, and stay out of trouble. And we will be back for another live streaming next week. Who will be the next inspiring individual from A to 